hi students here let us see an example uh, finding minimum number and the maximum number from the given two dimensional array so what i'm taking is i'm taking the one array with the size 10 by 10 and the number of the row values number of the column values for the column and the row and to store the value of the minimum and maximum i have taken the this minimum and the maximum for the repetition of the rows and the columns i n g for example here if my input is like this 3 by 3 matrix 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 from this one minimum value is the 1 and the maximum value is the 9 so this is the my expected result okay so here first what i am doing is i am taking the number of the rows here into the variable so rows and the columns and i am asking you to enter the those number of the values okay so let us assume here my rows and the columns for this example is 2 by 2 so i take row equal to 2 and the column equal to 2 okay now after reading the these values rows and the columns okay then First, I am initializing the minimum equal to a of 0, 0, maximum equal to a of 0. Let us take an example here. This is the my matrix is A. I enter the values something 0, 1, 0, 1. Let us see my values are 5, 7, 3, 2. Okay. So, here the minimum value is the 3, maximum value is the 7 here. What is the minimum value according to this first statement minimum equal to a of 0 0 so minimum equal to a of 0 0 is nothing but a value i have the 5 here and the maximum equal to a of 0 0 nothing also falls of 5 then after that what is i am repeating the loop again so this is the close of the inner for loop and this is the close of the outer for loop now see here So here what first i value is the 0 let's trace the program so this condition is the true and enter the loop j equal to 0 this condition is the true j less than 2 if a of i j nothing but a 0 0 0 0 how much i have the value here i have the value here 5 5 is less than minimum minimum is how much 5 only 5 is less than 5 the condition is the false so it doesn't execute it and else if 5 is greater than max 5 this condition is also false it doesn't execute it after this one where it goes it goes to the j plus plus j value now become 1 so 0 1 at the 0 1 location i have 7 here so a of 0 0 is 0 1 is 7 7 is less than 5 condition is the false and here 7 is greater than the 5 so condition is the true then i am changing the maximum value maximum is equal to a of 0 1 nothing but you need to take this one so max equal to now it is 7 then after that j value becomes the 2 2 less than 2 condition false whenever this condition is false what happens i will be incremented by 1 when i is the 1 1 less than 2 the condition is the true again j starts from the 0 so 1 0 is nothing but a value is the 3 here so a of i j now a of i j is how much it is uh, 3 3 is less than 5 yes minimum sorry minimum value okay 5 now minimum equal to now it will become the 3 then else part doesn't execute it goes to the j plus plus j1 nothing but a 1 1 1 1 is nothing but a we have the value to here 2 is less than minimum minimum is how much now 3 2 is less than 3 yes condition is the true again you modify its value to Two. else part doesn't execute it j value become the 2 when this is the 2 2 less than 2 condition false increases the i value i value is the 2 2 less than 2 condition is the false so it's terminated this loop after this termination of the outer loop also i'm printing the minimum value is the mean maximum value is the one so how much here how here minimum value is the 2 i have maximum value is the 7 okay so this is the logic how do i 
identify it. Let's see here. Test the values. Just take the two by two. Now let's take the values as five, three, okay, five, seven, two, one. So minimum value is that's giving the two, maximum value is the seven. Okay, this is how we find out the minimum and maximum number from the given two dimension. So, 